welcome to my channel my name is Nikki thank you for stopping by today's pour it is on an 18 by 24 canvas and it's a swipey 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 swipe a whole bunch of swipes um it's kind of like the multi-directional swipe but I'm going in all the same direction but it's broken up into those small smaller swipes to make up the hole um so yeah it's kind of that mentality can you hear can you hear the sound that is rain on the roof of my car y'all rain on the roof of my car i'm sitting in the parking lot of a church because i was trying to sit in the parking lot at work to do this voiceover but people step they kept stopping at my car talking to me and i'm like holy geez so i drove down the road to the church and I'm parked in the church parking lot so I can do this voiceover so let's just have a little conversation um and talk about this first I love the way this um swipe come out to me it looks kind of like sea foam um and I'm just really happy with the way it come out this is the first time I've done a swipe like in this sort of manner i'm sure other people's done swipes like this i'm not claiming originality in no sense of the word but um yeah this is the first time for me that i've done a swipe in this manner and that white that i just dipped my little piece of acetate in has got silicone in it but that's the only paint that has silicone in it um yeah so we just do some little swipey swipes and um because i wanted to do a large piece in a swipe but it's really hard to do like one continuous swipe on a large canvas so in the in this sort of way you can do it on like a 12 by 24 with that double length um but whenever you do it like on a canvas in this kind of format it's kind of hard so i was like well let's just break it up into like the multi-directional swipe but let's just all go in one direction and so that's what i did so that was my mentality behind it now you'll see me put down paint and then i scrape it off the reason i scraped it off is because i dropped some of that paint that had um silicone on it and um i didn't know how that would like it might mess up the pattern or whatnot so i scraped it off and put down another layer of paint um that was just me being careless and i wasn't sure how it was going to work in it so i was just taking precautions so um anyway today is tuesday march the 23rd yes it's march the 23rd um i am so happy that i am able to talk um last week i was very 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 sick um i caught chemical pneumonia which if you have never heard of chemical pneumonia don't feel bad because i had never heard of chemical pneumonia before i caught it but i caught it because of something that happened at work um and i'm not going to go too much in it i work in law enforcement um it was just it was relative to work and i got very very sick and um yeah i was very sick but today yesterday was my first day back to work in like a week um and i was not i was like oh my goodness i tasted missy and i'm like i feel like i've been running over a mat by a mat truck because i was the first time i had like really gotten up and was having to do stuff um and i was just like oh i can't breathe but today I'm feeling much better. I got some good rest and um, yeah, I'm feeling so much better. Like so much better. My voice is still a little bit like, mm, but nothing compared to what it was like um, last week. It was awful. I, it, it was just awful. And that's why I, the last video I posted was just music because I literally could not do, I couldn't do a voiceover. Um, so I just, you know gave y'all some nice music to listen to shorten the video um and i hope you guys still enjoyed that so anyway chemical pneumonia um i don't ever want to have it again it's miserable i think it's probably worse than like um the other kind of pneumonia i just think it is it's like my lungs were on fire it hurts so bad 
Um, but we're better now. We're better now. And I'm not going to dwell on it because you guys are going to say, Nick, you are always sick. And it seems like, yes, I'm always sick. I don't know. It's just like the older I get, the more sickly I get. Oh, I can't stand it. Um, but what else is there to talk about, you guys? It is rain. It started raining this morning at like 4 o'clock this morning. And it's supposed to rain Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. And they're saying that we're supposed to get up to 8 inches of rain. Y'all, I don't want 8 inches of rain. No, we just had like 12 inches last week. We don't need it anymore. It needs to go away. Um, but it's Mother Nature. What can you do? Plus, it's like springtime in South Mississippi. It always rains in this time of year. March and April, there's lots of rainy season in that time frame. So, it rains a lot. Um, what else? Um, Lanny had a birthday party. We had a little birthday party for Lanny. It was very small. We're still being mindful of, um, you know, just not having big groups and that kind of thing because COVID is still a thing. Um, so we are still being mindful, but we had a little birthday party for Lanny and, um, he, he, um, seems to have a lot of fun and his theme was Paw Patrol and, um, Lanny, what was your, um, what did you have for your, for your birthday? Lanny watches my videos. See, in the last time when I went over to the house, he said, Nana, you got to talk to me in the video. So, I can't remember all of Lanny's themes. Maybe his mommy can put it in the comments. But he had Paw Patrol, Paw Patrol, I think, and some PJ mask and something else. But I can't remember. But he'll tell us, I'm sure. Um, so we had a little birthday for, for Lanny. He's getting so big and I love him so much. I want him to stay little, but I want him to get big too. So I don't know. It's a rock and hard spot, you know? He's going to be too cool for Nick Nick one day and that's going to break my heart. Um, but yeah, let's see what else. Because I had, um, chemical pneumonia, I couldn't paint because the fumes from the flow trial and stuff like that. So my daughter's like, I know you love to paint, but you can't paint right now. You need to get better first and then go back to painting. So I haven't been able to paint, but what I have been able to do is adult coloring books. Um, and if you have TikTok, I do post on TikTok more often than I do on YouTube. YouTube is like longer, more in-depth videos and that kind of thing. TikTok or is like... 30 to 60 second clips um but i posted some of my adult coloring over on tiktok um and that was that's been fun i've really been enjoying that and so i've been trying out different marker sets and stuff like that um and some of them have been a big flop and they weren't cheap and i was very unhappy with them and then some of them i found were really great and they were actually affordable so that's um that's been fun exploring that and also i've been i have paint pours that i've done that they've dried and maybe they um especially the bloom pours when i first started trying to learn it they had like cracks and stuff in the paint um and so i for bloom pours especially i don't like pouring over those canvases just because the paint is quite thick on there um that's just my personal preference if you recycle canvases that's awesome um it's just personally for me i don't like to recycle canvases where the paint's really thick on them and i don't feel like taking the time to like try to clean it off so um normally i just pass them along to like um the thrift stores or something like that but there's been a few that i really like the composition but it just had like a few cracks on it or whatnot and i'm like Ugh. I really like this but it's not something that I would want to share as like art because it's got imperfections so what I've been doing is kind of taking on that uh, mixed media and put in like embellishments and this sort of thing on it and it's really um, they've really been turning out great and I've actually sold um, about four pieces with those embellishments on it and people really seem to like them which i don't usually i don't sell my art a lot just because i don't do it online because i it's I'm, my plate is full um and that takes a, a bit of time and it's quite an endeavor 
to you know make sure that your packages are shipped out and then i would worry that the packages gets damaged and maybe someone's unhappy with it and it's it's just a whole rigmarole to set up you know payment methods and all this stuff so i don't have a, a online store where i sell my art but people who um know me in real life um would reach out to me and say hey i really like this would you sell it to me and so um i have sold pieces you know to people um in my immediate area that know me that follow my social media um so that's been that's been um happening and i'm i mean you know um people find happiness from my art and i find happiness from my art so it's just like a really cool thing that um even whenever it's even when the piece of art that i created wasn't perfect and i was just like you know um that i was able to repurpose it and it still have value and um someone was able to enjoy that so that's made me really really happy um so that's just what i've been doing to kind of fill the time until i'm 100 percent back on the man i would say i'm about 95 percent there my throat still is a little bit sore and my voice does get raspy by the end of the day it'll be you know um a little rough sounding but I've, i'm so much better and i'm so thankful um yeah but of course i have videos on backup for times when i'm not able to paint i've mentioned this before and um i actually did this pour this swipe several weeks ago um so it's dry now it turned out really great there was no cracking no crazing it just it was just quite wonderful and i'm so happy with it so um yeah i, I like to show them after they're dried because you know then i know that the method i use is good and that if i give you any information about it it's good information and you can recreate it and have success so this is a dry piece see it's so pretty like the ocean waves like when they come on the beach you know foamies anyway yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed this i hope you're staying healthy and safe wherever you are um and i will speak with you all very soon bye